keep losing. What if I told you you can rent NFT cards to beat your ops easily? Uh, I'd say show me how. Let me do it for you. I connect my wallet, rent some NFT cards, add them to your deck, and Bob's your uncle. I never understood the Bob's your uncle reference, but thank you, mysterious voice in the room guy. Let's try out our new deck. All right, it's time to teach people how this amazing platform works. So in short, for games like Gods Unchained, you can rent very powerful NFT cards to use during weekend ranked matches and maximize your earnings that way. Or you can just rent out an NFT card that you wanted to buy to add to your deck to make it more powerful. So before you buy it, you want to test it out. This is also a way to do it. You rent it and test it. But that's for Gods Unchained. They have a lot more games to offer on their platform. You can rent NFTs that give you access to certain games. You can rent NFTs in order to earn in certain games like Axie Infinity. You get rent Renting credits just for signing up and there's so much, so much to show for this amazing platform. It is called Loot Rush. But now that you know what the platform is all about, let me show you how to use it. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is The Inspector. You're about to be mind blown. If you're new to the channel, subscribe, hit the little bell icon so you never miss out on future videos. And if you're really feeling the love, smack that like button in the face. It's the best way to show your support. And let's get this show on the road. Here we are, the Loot Rush website, rent all gaming NFTs, no smart contracts, wallet connect, KYC or credit card is required to rent. In order to access the website, there's a link in the description down below that you can click on and it will guide you directly to the sign up page. So here we are, Loot Rush NFT rental, just click on my link right here. And so you will get $5 worth of NFT rents just for signing up. If you have any gaming history on your wallet address, you will get more than $5. I personally got 10 when I signed up with my MetaMask. So you can sign up with your MetaMask or you can sign in with Google, email, Facebook. There's a couple options you can use here, but I'm gonna go back here to my account that I've already created. I have connected my MetaMask account and you do have a full experience here for a custodial wallet with their custodial wallet, the Loot Rush wallet, which can also be connected to God's Unchained. More on that a little bit later. Here we are. Look at all the games available for renting. Look at how many games there are. We have Undead Blocks, we have Axie Infinity Teams we can rent, Zed Run, Immortal Chess, Voxies, Block Lords, one of my personal favorites, a strategy game in crypto. So many options, even the sandbox, you can rent land in the sandbox. Now, there is something called the limit down here, and the limit is only there if you use a wallet like MetaMask. If you want to use a custodial wallet, Loot Rush's custodial wallet, you have no limit. Some people don't want to use a custodial wallet, and so they do have the option of using MetaMask, but then, in order to rent, you do have to leave collateral, and here is the limit for every asset. Now, once you do join, let's go back to Gods Unchained and see how you can actually rent an NFT. Let's say, for example, I want Radiant Dawn right here. I would go to Radiant Dawn and normally it will be $0.0012 per day just for this card. I will add it to my bag. I'll click on my bag right here and here is my loot. As you can see, I am using my free trial to get 100% off until I spent $50 worth of rents. Now, this is a feature that's available right now for early adopters, for you and me who are experiencing the platform right now. So I would suggest you try it out. You have literally nothing to lose if you just try it out. Later down the road, this feature will not be available, so might as well use it now. We click on continue, and since I've already connected my MetaMask wallet, and it's the same wallet that's connected to Gods Unchained, I have no additional things that I need to do here. I can just agree, click next, and here is the Loot Rush wallet, which is also an option. Well, we use my regular MetaMask wallet, which is what I prefer, and my order has been created. There we go. My NFT has been rented, and the delivery is in progress. Now, if you're using the Loot Rush wallet, the NFTs will automatically return, but if you use MetaMask or any non-custodial wallet, you will need to click on return assets right here. Here, I can choose all my assets and return them to their original owner, sign the transaction with my MetaMask wallet right here. Then since this is Gods Unchained, also sign with Immutable X and the status has been updated and the NFTs are going back to their rightful wallets. So you do want to keep this in mind so as to not waste your rental money and with the NFTs just sitting there and you not using them. Be sure to return your assets. 
So now you know how to sign up, very easy. Now you know how to rent, even simpler. And now you know how to return, also very simple. The only confusing part here, which might be confusing for you, is why do they have the two wallets? But as I said, here you go at the very top of the page, unlimited rental limit unlocked. Try it now. In order to try it now, I need to download their custodial wallet and add it to my browser. It's, it's a wallet, a browser wallet, just like MetaMask, but it is a custodial wallet. That way, you have no rental limit, it is fully safe to use, no KYC or credit card required, or and also no collateral is also required when using their custodial wallet. So some of you might find this more interesting than using MetaMask. I myself prefer not to use a custodial wallet for personal reasons. I prefer to use MetaMask. But there is no wrong option here if you do want an unlimited rental opportunity then you should definitely go ahead and use the custodial wallet which works very very well with their website of course it is their own wallet and it works perfectly now let's see what our options are here so we have Ronin network immutable we have polygon we have Binance we have ethereum so spider tanks available here as well uh, if we go to Axie infinity let's see if I'm eligible enough to rent a whole team so so also note that the sign up bonus does not work for Axie infinity and particular only for Axie it doesn't work but the cool thing about this is you can also rent with your credit card let's go back to the home page here go to gods unchained and as you can see there is also guides and news so for any game you pick let's say we go to spider tanks for spider tanks we also have the guides and news here so you do want to check out these guides for any specific game that you might find interesting or any specific game here that you already play and want to rent nfts for like let's say block lords you do want to go here and kind of see what what they have to say about it so i don't have enough collateral for example to rent this bryce leader and if i go to add to my bag i cannot rent it because i need an additional 77 dollars of co collateral in my credits bag but of course i can increase the limit by getting the loot rush custodial wallet which we've already gone through but i just wanted to make sure that you understand how all of that works all of this is very very interesting and very very intriguing if we go to the tokens page, we have the withdraw and deposit here. Here we can earn AXS Gods IMX Matic USD. So all of this you can do directly on their website, which is also a tremendous thing to see. You can also go to their website, click on how it works, where you have everything on tax. It is very simple. You can increase the limit with a custodial wallet. You can rent any NFT you choose. You can play with any NFT of your choosing, and then you just return it in order to not waste money and in order to be a good person, really. You can return the NFT. I will keep using it and I will keep promoting it because I think this is something that is truly needed in the web3 gaming space and something that is truly amazing and something that i will use on my own as well in order to try any of these games i don't want to particularly to spend thousands of dollars on an nft i do want to try the game out so might as well just rent it why not try the game out see if i like it if i do if i really like it and i see there's earning potential there's financial incentive for me to invest in an nft then yes of course i will invest in the nft but investing blindly is not something i like to do and so this platform will also allow me to figure out whether something is a good investment or not in the nft gaming space that's also besides the point something that i also really like is that here i can pick and choose the games i can see so many games that have nfts that have earning potential and i I can just browse here see any game that i think looks nice and there's so many games guys look at this there's so many games to choose from here let's see we can use ice poker from the central land and rent wearables ice poker on the central land is something i definitely want to get into uh, i might just rent me the full roman outfit here and be a roman roman emperor while playing poker in the central land <laughs> that'd be sweet but i do have the option to do that for as little as 0 0.2 two four one six dollars per day and let's go here to cross the ages for example and go from high to low so this is the most expensive rent that they have for this particular game it is 8.4 us dollars per day for the rent and i don't have enough limit i need two thousand and eight hundred dollars of collateral if i want to use metamask but let's say for argument's sake put it in my wallet of course i need more collateral so no one's going to be uh, putting this much collateral just to rent an nft it doesn't make too much sense what makes way more sense is to use the custodial loot rush wallet if you're going to be renting expensive nfts like this so i can 
can also pick how long I want to rent it for. I can rent it for 30 days and then you go 30 times 8.4. That's uh, how much money would be needed in order to rent this particular NFT for that long. Now, this is not a game I'm familiar with across the ages, but it does have expensive NFTs by the looks of it. It is on Immutable X and also Loot Rush Wallet compatible. Now, Cross the Ages is similar to Gods Unchained where it's a trading card game. Oh my God, that was loud. Uh, I just wanted to power up a YouTube video to see what this game is, but it is a trading card game, another game like Gods Unchained. I've not played this game. I am a huge fan of trading card games, so this might be something for us to check out in one of the videos in the future. Maybe we tried to rent some more NFTs here from Loot Rush. And as you can see, when I go to the most expensive NFTs, there's really only two NFTs that I don't have enough limits for with my MetaMask wallet. And that's because I have uh, $92 here as in my external wallet. And my limit here is $100. So there's a couple other ways to increase the limit without getting the custodial wallet. Of course, I can increase the limit by depositing collateral or I can give them my credit card or I can invite friends and get $5 per invite. Absolutely amazing what they're doing. I cannot recommend enough that you try their platform, that you try renting something, especially now because you can rent for free. You can try any of these games and try to rent a couple of NFTs for free. See how you like it. If you do, you keep using the platform. I will most certainly keep using the platform. Once again, Loot Rush, thank you so much for sponsoring this video. As I said, this is a sponsored video, but it is, it is a non-biased review. I genuinely am excited about using this platform. I have been using it. I have even promoted them without them even asking me to do it in my previous video, on my Instagram, on my Twitter. None of those were sponsored. I genuinely am happy to use and promote their platform. And of course, you do have Refer to Earn. You can click here, Refer to Earn, and you can invite your friends or anyone really to join. And you can also get referral, referral money for inviting people over. So all in all, amazing platform. It works great. Nothing else I can really add here. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and hopefully we'll see way more of Loot Rush in the near future. Take care, have a good day, and peace out.